Shima Pana, pineapple, yeah. She's so bubbly, she's so sweet, <laughs> yeah. She got an attitude, I call her pineapple, yeah. She's sweet with sour moods, I need another dapple. She got an attitude, I call her pineapple, yeah. She's sweet with sour moods, I guess she's all I'm after. My little girl got a sour side, but you know I'm a sucker for some sweetness. Every weekend, pulls you and she knows your weakness. I tell her she's my princess, she just wants to be queen. I call her pineapple, and she says, What do you mean? She got an attitude, I call her pineapple, yeah. Good morning guys. So for today's outfit, I have some ripped boyfriend jeans from American Eagle. Um, I have this really cute graphic t-shirt that has like cute little flowers on it and then the names of each flower is in like scripty font. Ew. <laughs> and then for my shoes, I have my super, super worn out Converse, white Converse, which now look literally gray. And then I just tied the shirt in a little knot right there, and that is my outfit. I know not what you would expect for someone to wear in a corporate office, but we are very, very relaxed in our office. So our dress code is basically just don't show too much skin, I guess. I don't, I don't know how to describe the dress code, but this is work appropriate <laughs> in our dress code. So I'm gonna make some breakfast now, and I will update you guys in a second. She got an attitude, I call her pineapple, yeah. She's sweet with sour mood, I guess she's all I'm after. Yeah, take a slice and look inside, you see the sweet, the nice, the harmless vice, the cold as ice. I need my pineapple consistently, I eat religiously, I need my sweetness instantly. And every time that she's around, she's sweet, I'm silent, then she's sour. Just wait an hour, my little flower. So this morning I usually don't go this big for my breakfasts even though I'm always starving um, but I made an English muffin with egg, Swiss cheese and tomato and then I made my matcha with blueberry lavender almond milk which is absolutely amazing if you guys haven't tried that drink from Trader Joe's you have to give it a shot and then I cut up some blueberries and strawberries and bananas and I put them into the container. So I'm running really behind this morning, so I gotta get going. Um, yes, I'll keep you guys updated. Okay, so I'm driving to work. Um, I work about 35, 40 minutes away. So depending on traffic, that's how long it takes me to get there. It's currently 8.35 and I'm supposed to be at work at 8.30, so I'm running a little behind, like I said. So hopefully um, there's not too much traffic, but I just stuffed down that breakfast sandwich. I ate it super fast in the car. I didn't even think I was that hungry. And then I started eating and it was like gone. So luckily I brought the fruit and my matcha. So I'll still have a little bit something before lunchtime. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the office. The first thing that I do when I get to work is open up my email and see what emails I need to respond to for that day. 
Then once I do that, I get my notebook and I physically write down all the emails that I have to respond to, any projects that I have to work on, and just things to keep in mind for that day. After that, I will get my AirPods and plug in for the day. And it just helps me keep in the zone and, you know, everybody's talking and working at the same time. So it helps me concentrate when I have music to listen to. After that, I will sometimes collaborate with my team members. There is Gary that I'm talking to. Um, he's on my team and as you can see, we're just discussing some projects that we're working on. So it's now 12.21 and we usually have lunch at 12, but um, we we're kind of working into lunch a little bit today and they have salad today for lunch and I'm just really not feeling salad. So I think I'm gonna go somewhere else with some of my coworkers and see what we're gonna get. So um, yeah, I'll be back. Um, we usually get back from lunch at one. Um, so I'll be back from the office at one. <laughs> into the grind of things. I always feel so much more productive after lunch, which by the way, I didn't just have a coffee. I actually got one of their Caprese paninis, which I love. Now I'm working on some inventory reports and finalizing some things in the calendar for the month to come. So it's currently 5.26 and I'm still here at work. Usually everybody leaves by five o'clock but um, I've had a lot of work that I have to get done because I have tomorrow off and um, it's gotta get done. So I'm um, just finishing up some stuff. Hopefully I should get out within like 20 minutes, um, but we'll see. All right, so update, it is now 5.55, still in the office, but I am leaving, thank God. Yeah, it has been a very productive day. I'll give you guys some more info when I get home. All right guys, I'm here back at home and I'm about to start making dinner. But before I did, I just wanted to kind of recap my day since I really wasn't able to talk much um, at work today. So I wanted to basically explain to you what I really did throughout the day. I know you guys saw me on the computer a lot. Um, and that's all I did. I was at, my job is to be in front of a computer, answer emails, plan things, and yeah, we're gonna jump into that. So basically, in the morning, I will go in and check my emails. Um, we do work with another team and they work overnight. So I respond to those emails, I flag them, and then whatever I have to respond to directly, I make sure to flag so that I know I have to take care of that that day. And then what I do after that is I write those things down in a to-do list um, in my notebook, which is also what you guys saw. That's just because I'm a very hands-on visual person. So even though I have it in my email and I will check it off in my email, I like to check it off on a piece of paper as well. I just, I'm a to-do list freak. <laughs> so I love doing that sort of stuff. Then I will start answering my emails depending on the day. Today's Thursday, so we normally have meetings on Thursday mornings, but this morning um, it was a little different. We didn't have a meeting this morning, so you guys didn't get to see me in that. Normally we do have a meeting at 9.30 to kind of kickstart our day. I'll go through the meeting, and then I will get back into my emails, start responding to things. Proofing banners is a part of my job. A big part of my job is planning out a calendar of promotions, so I'm in charge of planning out those promotions and seeing that everything about that promotion goes through smoothly. So the copy for the banners, the percentages, the coupons, I do all of that. So that's what I'll be doing for the entire day is making sure that all the entries are in for the calendar 
and making sure that everything is taken care of for those entries. So that was a large portion of my day. And then throughout the day, I will interact with the rest of my team and sort of say what I need from them. I work with a graphic design team, a copy team, a newsletter team. So all that is part of my job is to communicate with those people to make sure that everything is getting done for those promotions. Sometimes we have to put out fires and that's just when we have to get stuff done. So. Like I said, tomorrow I do have off, um, taking off because I have to get some stuff done with my car. So I had to make sure to get everything done. You know, there are certain deadlines and I had to reach those. So that's why I stayed late today. It's been pretty common that I do stay late, about 30 minutes to an hour recently. Um, it's just been really busy at work, but for the most part, other weeks I do leave around five o'clock so I hope you guys like this day in the life of a marketing associate I hope this gave you some insight in what exactly a marketing associate does I know I had to be a little bit vague because I can't give like explicit details of what I'm working on and who I work with and stuff but at least I kind of was able to give like a like overall description of what I was doing and you kind of got to see what I was doing. For any of you that are interested in going into marketing or things similar to that, I hope this kind of gave you guys a little bit of an insight on that. Um, and if you guys have any comments, you know, I can answer more specific comments, but I wanted this to be like a kind of overall video of what I do and what my day is like pretty much every day, except for Saturday, Sundays. So if you guys have any comments, please leave them down below. I do respond to all my comments. And if you did like this video and if you do like me, make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. I really appreciate any support I can get and I will see you guys next Monday. Bye guys. Bye.